Fishing for tuna is an important economic activity in the Maldives in terms of foreign exchange, livelihood and food security. 20% of the workforce are engaged in fisheries and fishery-related activities and contributes to 4% of the country's GDP. For Maldivians, fishing is not just an economic activity or an industry. It is an integral part of our identity and the way of life. Maldivians have been engaging in this sustainable and environmentally sound way of fishing for centuries. Tuna is caught using a pole and a line and a hook, one fish at a time. The way that we can, uh, or the international uh, mechanism for managing these stocks are through uh, regional fisheries management bodies. As such, uh, Maldives plays a very important role in the Indian Ocean Tuna Commission to make sure that the tuna stocks uh, are maintained uh, at its uh, sustainable level and that uh, we make sure that uh, it's not threatened uh, for future generations uh, so that we can get the most benefit from the from the skipjack resources. Key environmental benefits from our one by one pole in line fishing has no bycatch, is dolphin friendly and have little to no harmful interaction with non-target and endangered, threatened or protected species. Decades of fishing sustainably was rewarded when the fishery was certified by the Marine Stewardship Council in 2012. Fishery is not only environmentally sound and sustainable, it has an immense social impact, especially in the outer atolls. The fishery operates in such a way that all fishermen work together and receive an equal share after each fishing trip. Each boat engages a lot of fishermen as fish are caught one by one, providing employment for a number of people from the island community. Fishery is usually family driven. Approximately 10 to 15,000 people are directly involved in pole and line fishing. Fisheries also received fair trade in February 2017. Last year, uh, Maldives was uh, very happy that uh, we, we, we were able to pass a landmark resolution uh, to manage uh, skipjack stocks while the stock is not yet at a level of uh, unsustainability. Uh, however, uh, we still need to do a lot of work in this area to make sure that uh, the uh, good resources, the uh, fisheries resources are passed into next generations. Since Maldives became a full member of IOTC, it has been at the forefront of the sustainability agenda in IOTC. True sustainability of a fishery is achieved through harmonized coexistence of the people and the ocean.